Hey guys, come on now. It's dangerous. That reminds us of the old days out of Cotton One. I love it. JJ getting a free ride. Now here's John Durand trying to make another birdie. Just leaves it low side, but he'll tap that in for par. And here is Jonathan Lambert's playing partner, Jared Scott, trying to get up and down. He leaves it a little bit long. There's JJ with that famous pre-shot routine. JJ hits a nice one right down the middle. Now here's a legend, John Boglin. Great to see him out here. Oh, what a nice drive for John. A little bit of a baby draw there, bringing it back into the center of the fairway. Now here's Jared Scott trying to make par. Just misses on the high side. Of a, a putt for bogey there. Here's John Duran with that famous right foot back stance. He's always had it. Helps him to, to make a big turn and generate a lot of power. And he's doing the famous John dance, playing the music. You gotta love it. Here's Frank Bailey for birdie. Frank is a longtime Cottonwood player. It's looking good. Oh, and some curling help, but it doesn't quite make it. He'll tap that in for par. Here's Olavsky. Now he's tapping in for bogey here. He's playing to a 15 handicap, so bogeys aren't going to kill him. And uh, a rather nice bogey from being in the swamp. Here's Jared Scott. Oh, this thing is right on the flag. Oh, one of the better shots of the day. Believe it or not, he did not win any prizes. You can see that other stake there. You guys were firing at that flag. That was hole seven. And here's Brock Gillespie, hole 18, which I believe is his 13th hole. A little bit of a knockdown now. That's going to go left. He's not going to like that one. He's in the sand. Well, once again, thank you for playing the Cartel Invitational Tournament. We get a good look at Riverwalk here. It was a wonderful day. Probably about as good as Riverwalk will ever look. Now here's Chris Bono. A little bit right, but a nice three wood down there. He'll have a, an up and down chance for par. That is one of the tougher holes on the course. Now this right here is a very tough putt. This is Mike Massey. One of the better putts of the day. Watch this thing trickle down. What a great lag putt there. And he's gonna have that for a tap in par. And here's Frank Bailey. He's got the face wide open. Oh no, it's short. Here's John Durand. He's been putting pretty well today. Oh, great putt by John. Gives it the fist pump. Now here's on the same hole, here's JJ, John Johnson. Putting for par, oh yeah. JJ walking it in. This green has been good to everybody. Let's see if Frank Bailey can make it three in a row for this group. Yes. No. Oh. Yes. He puts it in. Fist pumps all around. And play has slowed up a little bit on hole number five. Five Presidio. And we got Chris Bono here looking pretty stylish waiting. I think we're going to have to come back. Here we go. Here's Brock Gillespie, hole 18. Uh, I, I, I've been told that this is for bogey. He really needs this one. Oh, yeah. Very good, buddy. Thank you. Almost a 360 roll around and in. He'll take it. Here's JJ on his approach here for par 5. Seems to like it. Oh, just left it a little bit short, but not too bad. Here's John Boglin. Hey, John, how you doing? Good to see you, buddy. Here's Brock Gillespie. Driving on hole five, he's going to try to go over the river. Now this is his last hole. He is currently leading the tournament. And we got Philip Scott on 12, walking to the drop zone area. We're going to have to go this back. This going in though. Now, who this is, I don't know. But guys, this is not condoned by the Cartel Invitational Committee. Whoa. I hope he wasn't one of the leaders. Uh, anyhow, we got John Durand chipping the par five likes to go with that lob shot throw it up in the air 
And not bad. He'll have a nice uphill three and a half footer for par. Now here's Bono. Play has resumed over there on hole five. And Bono hits a decent shot. Here's Chris Silkey. Trying to make a comeback today. This is his third shot. And let's see where it ends up. You know, it's not bad from there. He's going to have about six and a half, seven feet for his par. Here's JJ, John Johnson, on the par five, left it a little bit short. Now here's Mike Funes, one of the better bartenders out at uh, Riverwalk Golf Course, running a little bit past. Probably not going to be too pleased with that. Now here we got Mike Massey. Got about 15 and a half feet and just pushes it past. Now we're coming down the stretch here. Here's Brock Gillespie. Second shot. His final hole. Hole five. Where is it? Oh! Almost goes in the hole. He's going to have about three and a half, four feet for birdie there. And that would take him into the lead if he right. makes that. There's Chris Silky cleaning up. And here is Ed the Roofer, playing barefoot, a la Jim McMahon. Ed runs it down and almost makes it, just misses low side. And here's Chris Bono's buddy, leaving it a little bit short on the chip. And here's our final putt. This is Brock Gillespie for birdie. Let's see if he can make it. Oh yeah, it's in the heart. John, thanks for a great tournament, buddy. Here's our final standings. Tom Orlowski takes the low net. Brock Gillespie, the low individual gross. Let's get to some interviews. Take it over, John Pick. Hey, had a great time here at uh, Riverwalk playing in the uh, tournament here. And uh, I met a couple of new friends, and they played really good. We had a really good time. My friend Tom was awesome again. And this is Mike. He was awesome. And uh, we, I would just like to say thank you. And we had a great time. And uh, everything is beautiful. <laughs> Good word. All right. Just tell me a little bit about how the day went. The day was beautiful. Playing with friends. Had a great time. Had a couple of major birdies that ended up being bogeys. But other than that, it was a good day. My buddy over here knocked two out of bounds and still saved far. Fabulous day. Well, that's for the replay because I can't. <laughs> I can't it. And, and also tell them about your handicap friend here. You're already handicapped. No, we don't need to talk about it. Yeah, well, no, it's a good day. Correct, good word. Thank you. And here's the meet. John Duran counting the scores up at the end. This is what most of us remember. Thanks again, John. What a great turn. All right, we'll see you next year. The Cartel Invitational 2019 is happening. There will be more details at the website, cartelinvitational.com. Once again, thank you for watching this video. Look forward to seeing you guys next year.